well, my car has messed up again. It's not running right again. And I already had to replace the alternator down there and change out the battery. And uh, honestly, this man, it just, it kind of wears on you. And you kind of think, man, you know, you know, it's not unexpected for cars to mess up, but but it just comes to your point like, man, your resources, they feel like they, you know, you just can't keep up with it sometimes. So here's another thing I got to, you know, ask God about and pray about. And it kind of got me down today thinking about it, you know, because now I got to go right back on the bus and do some other things. I can, the car still runs and all, but, you know, it just is a noise that I have to deal with. But I got to thinking, man, like, you know, normally we do worship every night at our house. And today I just didn't really feel like doing it because of this. And, you know, this thought came to me like, where does your joy really lie in? Is it really lying in God or the possessions that you have? And I got to thinking about that, you know, just because the car is messing up again, it shouldn't control or affect my joy in God so I had to really just think about like what am I really focusing on here so no matter what I'm going to have to keep on thanking God and worshiping Him and expecting God to deliver this situation into a better situation so I just want to encourage you guys just don't give up don't put your trust in things and things that don't go right and really check your focus and see where you really where your joy really comes from I'm praying for you all pray for me pray that I get this car fixed in time in Jesus name thank you so much